Hasn't been transformational yet. Cats haven't won a flag. They were a very successful club before, Pat, and they'll continue to be a successful club after. What he's doing is extraordinary, and if he takes the Cats to a flag along with the others there, he's going to be remembered even greater than he is at the moment. But transformational, I'm not sure what, what's different. Geelong former Brownlow medalist Jimmy Bartell with his take on Paddy Dangerfield. Here he is on the front of your footy record too, Craig. Well done on getting it out again. Now get it in news agencies in Victoria yeah. and beyond. Thanks, Gary. Um, what did you think of those comments from Jimmy? Is he too harsh on... Well, I think we understand what he's trying to say, but... You well, think? I think he's spot on, um, Hachi. We, we, we love Dangerfield and he's one of the best players we've ever seen, but it would be disrespectful for the coach to say that he's transformational for a club that, whilst Jimmy was there... I think there was a group was, of those premiership players, the up, old guard, who just retired that. in the last few years, who went, hang on, he's a wonderful player and he's a champion, but is, has he transformed our club? Inside the walls, maybe he has. Maybe he's done things that we don't know about. What do you mm, think, Matthew? Yeah, I, I, I can understand where Jim's coming from, but I can also understand that Chris Scott has a player come along that is, I'm not say once, but he's once every 20 years, Dangerfield. And Nick Revolt probably transformed St Kilda without actually winning a premiership for them. What Revolt did for everyone at that football club. Yes, but this was a guy who's come into a champion yeah. team yep. already. Yeah, but I, I just think that they were a brilliant team and they had some superstar players, but maybe Danger does things for Chris Scott. That yeah. And, and Chris that Scott didn't care because he repeated it again after the game and doubled down and sort of explained it even more. And there was a gap in the middle between Jimmy's. To, you know, there's a, there was a regression period. Well, and he's but been... would they have got? Would they have got to four, pre, three prelims? Would they finish no. on top of the ladder without Dangerfield there? So he's probably kept getting them to the top. I don't think he can be transformational unless he wins. He's, a, he's the best Is marketer it? they've ever had, like yeah. without question. But I made the point too over the weekend. If Tommy Hawkins wasn't suspended. They probably, probably might have mm. won that premiership last year.